Alright, what's gonna happen? So sorry, gotta make myself scarce. Later, pal. Yow! Uh-oh. Oh, no! At last, we reveal your true nature, Mr. Phoenix Wright! Gold. It would be too much to ask for you to be nice to me for a change. So you're the type to steal information from pitiful, hopeless detectives. That's very dishonorable of you. Ow. Hey, don't you dare run away, scruffy trench coat. Ah. I didn't think the detectives of this country would be this pitiful. Whoa. Detective, come over here for a second. Yow! <laughs> I feel better knowing at least you were man enough to face your punishment. He was so scared he just froze up on the spot. Mr. Phoenix Wright! You... you soiled my perfect prosecution record. I'll never forget that. This time, victory is mine! Victory is yours? Is that all this means to you? W what? Hmm. Come, scruff face. Investigation briefing is about to begin. Uh, yes, sir. This isn't over yet. I swear on my family's honor. Ow, now what did she throw at me? What is this? Well, I guess this means I gotta get back to the precinct now, pal. If you ever need me, come down to the Criminal Affairs Department, alright? And if you can, try not to let Miss Von Karma see you. Damn, okay. Huh. <clears throat> So what the hell was it that she gave us? Hmm. So, what do we see here? The glass of tomato juice, which looks like it's full, sitting on the desk. He's dead. All the stuff around him pretty much matches up with what we're seeing in the room. There is a missing button on his shirt. In fact, it looks like that's where the stab wound was, where the button was. Like, it wrenched it off. And, uh, there's your, there's your guitar case. Now, hmm, they said the guitar case was wet only on the top. In this photo, the guitar case is wide open. And there's your bottle of tomato juice on the table. Does all that match? Hmm. Let's go look at the crime scene and see if there's a difference. No, everything appears to match up. So he was sitting there on the on the table, right? He was sitting or he was sitting at this chair, dead. There's your wine glass sitting on the bureau where it was in the photo. There's your your case opened just like it was, right? And here's your juice on the plate. I'm going to look at the photo again. Because typically when they, they give you a picture like this, there's something wrong. Hmm. Well, the only technicality that I can really see, in this photo, the chair, if you look at it, is facing the table. You see that? It's like he was sitting aimed towards the table, right? Uh, the chair is not aimed towards the table in this photo. <clears throat> see that? It's not. It's aimed towards something else. Let's just examine the chair. No clues here. Art the glass fragment. Hmm. This looks the same to me. The guitar case. The guitar is missing. It's wet. Just on the top. 
Hmm. There's your wine glass again. It's full of tomato juice. Wait a minute. I think I figured it out. I think I figured it out. Check this out. This armchair is between the chair and the table. But in the photo... I fucked up. In the photo, the armchair's not there. Yeah, look, the table's closer. In the crime scene photo. Someone tampered with this room. Huh. There's no way you would be able to take the photo, right? from the behind the table where it is now and have this perspective. So the table was moved. And I think the direction of the chair was moved as well. So those chairs somehow were moved or the table was moved, one or the other. All right, well, I guess that's it. There's nothing else I can examine here, huh? Now, let's examine what, uh, what's-her-name left here. 